Hey, kids, it's Mr. Fly here. Merry Christmas to you. Hope you're having an absolutely fantastic time. Can't believe it. Another year has flown by. Another 167 videos, something like that, published this year. Not all of them have gone completely to plan. Stick around, stay tuned. I'll show you what I mean. Hey kids, it's Mr. Fly here. How you doing? Hope you're well. Pretty excited today because I'm on a bike that I really have been waiting a long time to ride. It's much requested. Today I'm riding for the first time the Royal Inter uh, Let's do that all again. Hey kids, it's Mr. Fly here. Hope you're well. You find me in a particularly excited mood because today I am riding a bike that uh, I've been wanting to ride for absolutely ages and it's been really requested and we've been waiting for. Oh, that's absolutely rubbish. We'll do that all again as well. I love these classic cock. Uh, <laughs> Hey kids, it's Mr. Fly here, hope you're well. Now for the last couple of weeks I've been lucky enough to ride this, the brand new for 2019 Triumph Tramps. Do it again. Hey kids, it's Mr. Fly here, hope you're well. Now for the last couple of weeks I've been a very lucky chap because I've been riding this, the Triumph Scrambler 1200 XC and I've really uh, got to know the bike. Well, bloody hell. So, uh, so much, from uh, Henry's Shed, that's it for now. I'm trying to remember what my catchphrase is. Until yeah. next time. Is that, it sounds good, Dad. Use remember, that. I can't remember what it's No, you use catchphrase. That. Just no. I'll, no. I'll edit this out, I can't remember. Catchphrase, what is it? What was it? Uh, uh, until next time. Oh, that, okay. Until next time, <laughs> this has been the Mist and Fly. Cheerio. Right, so I forgot the catchphrase, isn't it? But anyway, that, oh, was, that was brilliant. That was I can see you, but I can't hear you, mate. Can you hear me? Okay, I can see you nodding. <laughs> can you see me? I hope that's peach juice you're drinking. Oh, good guess. <laughs> we could have a very interesting interview with you just doing hand signals. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> uh, as to whether I go for one of these or not, but uh, really lovely machine. Um, there we are. Um, and I can't remember what else I was going to say, so we'll stop at that and we'll do it again. Okay, so there we have it. That's my uh, in-depth through. Uh, whoosh, let's do it again. Hey guys, Mr. Fly here. Welcome to part two of Bike News for March 2019. If you haven't seen part one, do go and uh, check that out. I'll put a uh, card up here somewhere so you can go and uh, have a look at that. Or is it up here? Not sure. Anyway, go and watch that first and then come back and watch this if you haven't seen it. So a uh, couple more newspapers to go through. Uh, MCN to catch up with the news from... Oh, let's do it all again. Three, two, one. Hey kids, Mr. Fly here, hope you're well, and welcome to part two of Bike News for March 2019. If you haven't seen part one, do go back and uh, watch that, follow this link up here, I think, uh, to go and have a look at that, and uh, uh, then come back here, and uh, I'll take you through another two, let's do that again. Hey kids, Mr. Fly here, hope you're well, and welcome back to the occasional series uh, on the channel called, what is it called? Reader's Rides, isn't it? Bugger, okay, let's do that again. Don't laugh, this could take a while. Hey kids, it's Mr. Fly here, hope you're well. Out and about on a beautiful sunny day today on another bike and I'm absolutely thrilled to say today I can hear the sound of thunder. It's Italian thunder, it's the Aprilia. Oh, let's do it all again. Right, to one of my favourite subjects then, cleaning the bike. Before I get on to actually cleaning the bike, let's have a look at where she gets dirty. Now, of course, it's a... Um... So let's just talk about a couple of the practical ownership points to do with the... Uh, looking after the VIP pillin if you have one of these. People ask, often ask me uh, some simple things that you wouldn't necessarily think. For example, what is the horn like on the new bike? So I can quickly demonstrate you that. Obviously the um, microphone isn't necessarily going to pick up what it's really like, but let's give it a blast. You can hear, at least hear the tone. Whoops, let's not do that. That'll be the starter. Uh, I don't quite know how to start this. Thing. It's, it's <laughs> bizarre, isn't it? I've been frightened, Rich. Oh, <laughs> So, here I am with none other than Richie Vida. How are you? Fantastic to meet you, Rich. It's a pleasure it's, uh, to meet you I've too. I've been watching Richie for four or five years now. Took him on a plane and, uh, f yeah, rode, well, flew into, I'm stuttering, let's start again. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay then, no problem. Right, here we go then. So here I am with none other than Richie Vida. It's fantastic. Thank you very much for having us on, or having it, let's do it again. <laughs> so, that's one for the Christmas tape. Okay then. Hey kids, Mr. Fly here. Hope you'll do it with the glasses on the head. So to the last book on this uh, review then of my uh, top three bikers books that I've ridden in the last, oh, ridden, read in the last six months. Let's do that again. Hey kids, Mr. Fly here. Hope you're well. You join me out on the big old Triumph Scrambler on a beautiful summer's day, heading out of Buckinghamshire, actually into deepest, darkest Oxfordshire, where today 
I'm going to uh, film another in my occasional series for the channel, Meet the Vlogger. And uh, in fact, I think I'm possibly underselling it today because it's a bona fide TV motorcycle celebrity I'm going to be meeting, none other than Henry Cole. So really looking forward to uh, meeting Henry, he of the motorcycle show, or the motorbike show, sorry, I should say. And uh, if you stick around and stay tuned, I'll still hold you. Hey kids, it's the Mr. Fly here, hope you're well. It's an absolutely beautiful day to be out on the motorbike. I'm out on the big old Trans Scrambler uh, again today. Beautiful bike to be riding in the countryside in England. And I'm absolutely, again, it's rubbish. Hey kids, it's the Mr. Fly here, hope you're well. Out and about on the big old Trans Scrambler on this beautiful British summer's day where I'm heading out of Buckinghamshire into deepest, darkest Oxfordshire towards the Cotswolds to film another in my occasional series, uh, my occasional series on the channel. Let's do it again. Hey kids, Mr. Fly here, hope you're well. Now, if you're interested in the KTM 790 Adventure R, this bad boy, you're gonna stick on, on, let's do it again. Okay, so as I say, I've been riding this bike as much as I possibly can over the last couple of weeks. I must just say a big thank you to the guys at BMW UK for letting me borrow the bike to get to know it. Uh, what I've done, I've ridden it as much, uh, uh, let's do that all again. So in this video, I wanna bring you a much more in-depth look at the GS Adventure. The, uh, so there we go, folks. There's a selection of uh, outtakes from 2019. Hope you enjoyed that. Just shows that it uh, doesn't always go completely to plan. Anyway, really looking forward to making loads more videos for you in 2020. Thank you very much indeed for watching uh, throughout 2019. Loads more to come. Lots of great ideas. Lots of stuff uh, to film for you. And uh, really looking forward to getting cracking with that. So uh, all that remains for me to say now is uh, Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. Have a fantastic time tomorrow with the kids and family. And uh, I'll see you again very soon. Till then, this has been the Mist and Fly. Cheerio. Merry Christmas! It's the Biston Fly here, hope you're well. And uh, another year's flown by, incredible Christmas special time already. That was a load of rubbish. Let's do that again. <laughs>